Well, welcome back to Brian Basketball. I don't know how long this video is going to be, but I'll tell you what. The last one, apparently they would not even upload it because the music was too loud. Uh, or something. I can't imagine why they wouldn't even... Since I don't get any kind of ad revenue, I don't know why they're uh, <laughs> messing with my uploads. I upload it twice. You'll see it over there on... Uh, I put them in the HGA. It was thank you to my subscribers. So anyway, uh, we got HGA going on tonight. And I think I'm getting in. <laughs> Y'all have to come back for that. Uh, because I got, a, I got a tweet from HGA. I guess I made it. But anyway, we're going to go through some cards. Uh, these are just some I grabbed. I've got so many guys. Y'all know. Y'all know. Here we go. These are some I got to select from. I'm, I'm just going to start stacking. Y'all can take a look at the Kobe's. I, these right here that I put in the Ultra Pro, I think have a really good chance at a 10. But not with HGA. Since I don't give them out, I'm thinking I'm going to get a 995. There's some more Kobe. Y'all might have seen that one before. Got two of them. They just keep the old line coming. Look at there. That's a pretty one. That's a smoker. Look at the shine on that one, guys. Top's finest. I think that's a 90. Uh, heck, y'all can see down here. Maybe. Heck, come on. Here you go. Oh, we're still coming. Y'all y'all might see some cards you never seen before. Even on eBay, I don't know. I've been looking up trying to find some of these. That that one there's for sure getting graded. That's one that's getting graded. Guys, this card here jumps off. Jumps off. Can you imagine that in HGA? I don't know what colors. Would I go with the team or with a go? I think I'll go with a card. Let's see if I can get this one in. Oh, there we go. I don't know. On your TVs, you might be able to see it. Oh, here it is. But that card is a banger. But, 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 banger. Bangers. Nothing but bangers. Nothing but bangers. Nothing but bangers. Who would go through their Kobe cards like this for y'all? Huh? They would go through their Kobe cards like this for y'all. Say, hey, look look what I got. There's a Michael. There's a Michael. There's a Michael. There's a Michael. There's a Michael with, full, with the protector on it. That's a good looking card. That's the finest. Look, look at those corners, guys. Yeah, these are these will be graded. Eventually, all of these that are in these will be graded. Uh, we're not done yet. Let's just. Oh, here we go. Here's some. There you go. You might have seen that one before. I love that picture. That's a good picture. I picked this one out, guys. I had like 15 or 20 of these. Look at the centering, how hard it is to get the centering on these cards. I'm thinking this is the only one I had that was even close. I'm telling you, I had a ton of these cards. To, to get one of these to 10 is going to be... I mean, as far as the corners and everything, the corners are all good. But it's a cool card. I got the newspaper. I've got two copies of this newspaper and two copies of the Tribune. Yeah, this is a tribute. Well, that's a Tribune to Michael, but I've got Chicago Tribune. Look at that. Mini Mint Fresh. Mini Mint Fresh. I can take a look. 
Even that black corner down there doesn't even have a snippy snip. I mean, eh, yeah, huh? All right, there's some black diamond. This one here is going to get graded too, guys. This one here, it was an insert. T take a look at that from the late 90s. Diamond Gallery. Jordan Diamond Gallery. JDG. The back of the card's not as cool as the front, of course. But that diamond's inside of it. If you were to look at that card, it has the same thing that that Kobe card had going on in the diamonds. And there's little diamonds in there. See that? How they glow? Ugh. Son. It's been too long. It's been too long on one card. I like that one. Uh, I think I picked these out. All these are Michael. But on the back of that one's Pippin. That's a cool one. Michael and Pippin. That's Upper Deck. Upper Deck made the best cards. Well, I really liked Upper Deck. I still do. Who's on the back of that one? Michael on Michael. There we go. Huh? How about little Michael from the back? That's a good looking card. I, I think I got seven or eight of them. I picked that one out. Oh, there's another Michael. Well, I was doing just picking out Michaels and Kobe's guys. And then I picked out a few extras to, to kind of... You know what? I'm going to keep on showing cards because I pulled so many last night. I stayed up late. Uh, but this guy here... The first Chinese citizen to ever play in the NBA is before Yao Ming. Rookie card. Number 1876. 1876. Cool number, huh? But, supposedly, he's still uh, pretty popular over there. Yao Ming, too. But, anyway, and I picked this one out. Uh, this is an insert from Fleer. This is like his second year, second or third year. What year is this? Oh, 2001. Hold on a second. That'd be his fourth year. Uh, 98. Oh, heck, I don't know. Heck, I just had to look it up. I knew it was a cool looking car, guys. And I know I looked in there and I couldn't find any really for sale. It's Fleer Futures. There's another Tim Duncan, newcomer. That's a hollow. I think there's only two of these graded. <laughs> and then I'll, I'll do in a couple Shacky Shacks. You know Shacky Shack. There's Shacky Shack rookies. There's a Paul Pierce rookie. I haven't seen that one come up graded. I don't know. That's a cool looking card to me. Uh, how they did the photograph and how they made that green behind him like he's flying. I think that's just a good looking card of Paul Pierce. And then I grabbed just one of Vincy. I saw this in there and the reason I grabbed it, look at there. It's a top finest insert with Kobe and Vince Carter that's basically on a piece of electronics, a meter. Look at his hand. That's cool. Alright. I don't know how far along the video's gone, but we're going to keep on going. Here's some more. These are ones... Now these, I, I didn't have time to put in the tall sleeves, but I'm thinking every one of these will be graded. Let's see if I can put this up here. I'm going to set this up like that, and I'm going to put this over here, and I'm going to stick them right back in the holder I had them in. But y'all, there's Michael, the gold foil. See the bottom there? I don't see any kind of real issues with that one. Michael, Michael, Michael. Can't get enough of Michael. Michael, Michael, Michael. The record, baby. Round, 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 round. Oh, 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 oh. 
That's a cool looking one. Yeah, the Michael exclusives, I just don't know if they'd hold their value if I got them graded, but I'm going to get some other ones graded first, but I'm going to get them all graded, guys, because, you know, there's no sense me leaving money on the table, and if I can help someone out and get them a graded card, I don't think people want to buy raw. This one here at the top, you see that little section there compared to this one over here? Yeah. See, it's, it's not quite, I mean, it's, but anyway, yeah, that one there, that's a hard grade. I got a, I did get a Kobe, I think, that has a perfect up at the top. This is a pretty cool one. Missed the cut. Look at that cut. Left to right. <sighs> Top to bottom's not bad. But that's a that's a good looking card. 123. There we go. Insert. There's a base. Collector's choice. I don't know. That might be an insert. Look how they did his name. It's Michael Jordan. And white. That one's off center too. That was right to left. Alright. Well, there's a couple more Michaels. And if you take a look on this one, see that edge right there? That'll be the problem that you have with these old, old tops. I found one that didn't have that, that bugger. I guess they just had some dull blades. But anyway, that's those. Alright. I think we're done. Oh, let's just put up half and half here. I got a full. All right, let's go with this one here. Oh, let me. Let's get this over here so they're not blinding you. Oh, that's just a checklist. Let's go my arm this way here so I don't put a shadow on them. Y'all probably seen these before. These are pretty common. But I've got a few. I'd have to relook these over. I think I picked one of these out to put in the, the deal. But you know what? I think they're all gradable. On the, the ultras come out pretty good. Even with all that black. I mean, look. Uh, that, that, that looks like marble down there at the bottom. This one here, I couldn't do, and I'm going to show you why. Do you see it? Right there on the corner. Right there by his foot. That's the only little mark on that whole black card, guys. Ah, oh, that's such a good looking card. That was the only mark. I'm like going, it's black, and that's the first thing they're going to see. They're going to see that little chip, and they're all already going to start off at an eight or something stupid but man the bottom is clean the sides are clean all but this one spot right here over here on this side on the right there but anyway on to the next I, it made me upset pick that one out a little Michael and Magic figure that they got the Michael and uh, our Kobe and LeBron stuff going on there's excellence. That's a good looking card. You're not going to see too many of them, I don't think. And I think that one's gradable. Even with the top part there, look at that. The edge goes right there and doesn't even, even flicker. Doesn't even come up at all. Man, that one there I should grade. But it's not... I mean, the back is just so unappealing. The game in pictures. Well, that is interesting. But anyway, on to the next. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, let's keep on stacking these over here. I'm putting them back in the holders out of them. There we go. Air of Greatness. 
That's a good looking card. Uh, I think I just decided that that was enough of those tall sleeves. Man, th this is a good looking card here. Gosh. But I picked the ones out with him jumping with his mouth open, mostly. I'm thinking those have a better resale value than just the, the steady jump shots. I don't know. Now this one here. Another one of those ones I wish I could grade. Look at that. It's just not good enough. I saw some stuff on it when you get it out. I think it might have a scratch on it on the surface. But I really like that card. That's intensity right there. But it's a checklist. So it's not much. That might be why I didn't do it as a checklist. There's Michael and his 23 Wizards. After he bought them. Some more Michael. Supreme Court. There's some more Michael. Now that one's not bad. As far as the top to bottom is off. Left to right's not bad. Top to bottom's off. Off just a hair. It's not as... It's probably 16th at the bottom. Shorter than the top. Well, there's another one. Yeah. Y'all have all seen the Michael Jordan there. Well, at least, maybe, I don't know. Maybe I need to slow down and let y'all take a look. That's a good looking card. Hobby Picks. Skybox. All right. Well, y'all think we're over? <laughs> this is what I did last night, guys. This is just what I did last night. I'm still going through stuff. I've got too much. Got too much. But that's a good thing to have, right? Let's get my other deal over here. All right. Which ones would y'all pick out? Which ones would y'all pick out to grade? I think that's just one card, yeah. There we go. Skybox hoops. Flare focus. I think the focus were less price and look at the top to bottom on that one guys. It's hard to see. The top is really thin. I mean that's a good looking card. I mean, it has an action shot on the back too. Them dribbling. A lot of people don't look at the backs because I, I think the backs are just as important in the front. If you get an action shot in the back, I think it should be twice as much. Especially if it's a different action shot. This one here has a little Nicky Nick up here in this corner. Hard to see that one, but that's why I didn't pick that one out. That, that's a good looking card. Yeah, the, the brown borders on that one's hard to keep clean. Some rookie we rewind or whatever. That one's just now, these are just like those ones that they're putting out now. Panini's putting out those wide visions of. That's how they should have done, instead of having LeBron really small jumping right there in the middle, they should have done something like that. Now that card is clean. That one's that one's probably available to be graded. But I think I might have picked out the best one of the the three or four I had. I, I just I just pull in and I was thinking if I oh there's another shack in here. Where'd that come from? Oh gosh. <laughs> Good thing to have, huh? Where'd that shack rookie come from? Just in my Kobe stack. Ah. Uh, more Kobe. Yeah, th this was this was two binders 
two binders that I went through last night, guys. I still got all those binders in there to go through. And other stuff. Other boxes I didn't even open. Uh, but I'll get to it. Hey, I'll get to it. No worries. No worries. Yeah, y'all seen that one before. And there's another one of them. See, that's why you don't want to grade them. I mean, if they're that... If I have that many of them, then anyone that opened up one of them boxes had a few of them. Unless I just got lucky. <laughs> but of course, I might, I might open three or four boxes of them. We didn't have breakers back then. We broke ourselves. Break until we broke. How about that? There's... Those are two good black diamond Kobe's. Black diamonds were a little bit more expensive than the other ones. Just have to go Skybox Dominion. That's a good looking card. There's a Stadium Club. Skybox Hoops. And uh, I guess we'll end it there. Uh, kind of give you an idea of what you just saw. <laughs> there's these all stacked up and then those are the ones I put to be graded that I can figure out how to do it <coughs> but anyhow as you can see, there's, oh, I don't know, probably 25, 30, 30 or 40 that I just picked last night. I could select part of these here to send off. I imagine most people are sending everything. I don't know. I'm going to check. I'm not going to spend any money on anything if I don't think it's got a good chance. Oh, yeah. Plus, we got, remember the, these here. These are those other ones. A shack and stuff. Yeah, I pulled a couple of shacks out to get graded. I think that they're worth it. But anyhow, I appreciate y'all stopping by and watching. And as always, pistols firing.